A word of advice. Welcome, welcome, my friend. I don't believe we've had the pleasure of speaking yet. I'm Fabio, Fabio Mondador, at your service. So you are. Let's, uh, let's get a good look at you. You look sturdy, weathered, if I may. You may be exactly what I'm looking for. Excellent. Now, I'm a generous benefactor, and a good friend at that. Ask anyone, they'll tell you. But I, uh, I want to start you off small, see if I can trust you. You prove yourself to me, show me you can handle a bit of, uh, challenge, and then the real work can begin. How does that sound? Simple as, my friend. There's some uh, ne'er-do-wells hanging around the casino quarter trying to rough up the family's patrons for a few caps. Pathetic, isn't it? Regardless, I need you to deal with them. How you do so is up to your discretion. In fact, I would be curious to learn your methodology. You deal with them, and I promise you, you will be well paid. We, uh, take care of our own here. Now, do we have a deal? Your words are reassuring. Let's hope your actions mirror them. Come back when our friends outside are dealt with. But do say hello to Don Quintino for me. I'm sure you'll meet him. Soon. May a Tim fancies himself the leader of AC? <laughs> like some old farmer's gonna whack anybody. Before him, and his paw before him. Kill a guy, and then the mob shows up to recruit. Happening place in Asia. Hold it right there. I don't think you belong here. Yeah, okay, you know what? Mind telling me what you're doing walking in here like you own the place? Maybe. Maybe not. You don't look like a muni to me. Don't know why it matters to you. Sounds to me like you got steered in the wrong direction. We've been shaking some people up for caps, as you put it. But not patrons. The fact that you use that word tells me that the family sent you. <laughs> We've been shaking up Quintino's louts for their caps. Who's going to miss a few mobsters? I'm not an unreasonable woman. How about you just turn around and walk away? And I'll forget this ever happened. Hey, whoa now. There's no need for that. Uh... You want us gone? Fine. We're gone. Uh, you can tell your little family that we won't be causing problems around here anymore. In fact, I've uh, heard the boardwalk is quite nice this time of year.
Did you have something else to ask, or uh, are you just lonely? It's lonely. So you did, so you did. And in your own way as well. Very, very interesting. Yeah, words can only tell you so much about a person, but actions? Well, actions tell you everything. That gang of lowlifes I sent you to track down was just a test. A trial run. See if you can handle the real work that needs to get done. You see, my organization, the Lombardi family, we've been uh, disorganized for some time now. Rudderless, filled with questions. It's not good for a cult of personality to lack one, you understand? Now, as I'm sure you can see, I'm not Quentino Lombardi. I'm not the Don. Yet. Quintino himself has been uh, absent for some time, silent. He's not in his character. We've been told he's just been ill from old age. At the very least, that's what his kid sister Concerta has been saying. She's been strutting around, giving orders, claiming they're from Quintino. Not all of us are foolish enough to take such things at face value. I need you to play detective for me. Dig up dirt on her. Find the truth. If Quentino is, for whatever reason, gone, then the position of Don is open. And I would be very interested in that position. I could reward you quite handsomely. Do you think you could do some digging for me? <laughs> yeah, I didn't think you'd turn an opportunity like this down. As to where you should start, look to the Neapolitan Casino. Concerta lives in the largest suite within its hotel wing. I need you to search her room and find whatever evidence you can. That woman is hiding something, I know she is. And when you learn the truth, whatever that may be, return to me. Don't come back until you do. crawling out of the barrens. Like, what's a plant gonna do? Grow at me? It's a shoe bag. I should join the Munis. Do something useful for a change. Uh, how's your luck?
time and no work in television.
What's it take to get me? is changing tonight.
head down to the pier and catch a show. So, you're the catalyst that will bring down my brother's empire? You, and you alone? Fascinating. Well, you could say I have a bit of a poetic streak. As for Fabio, he's more of an actor than a poet. He lives in his verbiage instead of writing. What's it take to get Nevertheless, I, just... I hope you can look past my honeyed words to see through to their meaning. I don't expect you to pity me. The mad queen of Atlantic City. <laughs> Whose subjects could and never would respect her if she stepped out of the shadows. I've been standing in the shadow of my brother my entire life. The machinations of the family emanating from my whispers in his ear. It wasn't until he found peace that I started to lose my foothold. He was my shield, the visor that obscured my visibility in the public eye. But now, he's gone. Not by my hand, mind you. Mm -mm. But by the very oh, substance that the made him rich. Out of the, the only other contenders for the Godfather's chair are fools. They will run the Empire, for which I bled my entire life into the ground. I did not take the family from Quintino. I made it for him. What am I supposed to do with all this free time and no working television? And what would that be, pray tell? The spotlight was never mine to be had. I was forever lurking beyond its limits, searching for a way. But I am sure you've seen the barrier. That separates light from darkness. There is no door. Those like me, who linger in darkness, are not meant for such light. That is... unfortunately quite clear to me now. The truth is cold and harsh. <laughs> but there is one thing that cannot be denied about it. It's ferocity. Fabio can have his throne. Empires rise and fall, raise and simmer. If it's time for mine to do so, then maybe I just have to accept it. I won't fight you on it. I knew a lost cause when I see one. And I shattered my mirror for that very reason. Yeah, one more time. I think I'll head down to the pier and catch a show. There is much at stake here, but more than you can your vacation wear you uh gonna make a necklace out of those caps or what's it take to get me kill a guy and then the mob shows up to recruit is there something i can assist with <laughs> a peaceful transfer of power yeah yeah, I'm sure she believes that. Still, it'll uh, make her more vulnerable, more uh, resigned to her fate. Should be easier to take her out. So, you have done me quite the service after all. Certainly. Oh. Don't offend me so cruelly. I never forget to reward those who serve me faithfully. 
You've done well. Very well. Exceptionally well. And your reward? Well, your reward will match your success. I was not lying when I said I'm a very generous benefactor and friend. You've made a friend out of me, Arbiter. Now, how about we get you back to Appalachia? You came in on that uh, vertebrae, didn't you? Your reward will be waiting for you there. How come the Munis need so much money? What, you gotta pay the electricity and cut or something? One thing I don't miss? Driving. Oh, I've seen one too many jerseys. What's that cologne you're wearing? Oh, they... Crazy. 